So this book is the first time that uh, Wintin has a book about his life, about his career as a journalist, but also his time in jail, 19 years in, in prison, but also how he is now struggling for democracy, being free, but still under the, the police watch. So this, this is the first and unique opportunity for Wintin to present his opinion and how important was his commitment to democracy, to create the NLD, to fight for press freedom during the win time, to be one of the um, I mean, students and journalists who has been uh, promoting uh, peace and uh, dignity and, and democracy in Burma for now 80 years. So it's a very unique book and I think it, it's, a, it's a story, it's a Burmese story that will help to understand that the people who are uh, fighting for democracy, like Wintin, fighting as a, as, um, a political activist, are the people that uh, need to be at the leadership of Burma and not, and not the military junta. First of all, because he has um, faced so many different periods of the Burmese life. Uh, he, has been, uh, he, he has been a witness of the war, World War II. He met uh, the father of the nation, uh, Aung San, when he was a kid. He has been, uh, at the time of the democracy and the civil war, he was also a witness of all these events. And he has been, as a journalist, someone who has been investigating, denouncing, also traveling out in the outside world, getting information about the Soviet Union and so many other things that uh, were quite rare at this time. And also because his testimony in, in 19 years of detention in Insen is a very unique one. Uh, many people have been detained in Burma, of course, many uh, political dissidents, many journalists, but 19 years, it's so unique and it describes very well how the political prisoners try to fight against uh, this terrible regime of uh, repression in the East. So, uh, of course, we can, we can ask so many uh, Burmese people to, to write their life because they, their experience is, is uh, very important to tell. But uh, the, the one of Wintin is very crucial and it helps to make clear that the fight for democracy is not finished and that people like Wintin should and must play a key role for the future of the country. So, so far this book is only in French, so it will be distributed in France, in Belgium, in Canada, in Switzerland, where the people can read French. But we hope that, uh, because it's a very unique uh, and exclusive uh, testimony, that it will be translated in other language. And I think it will help, like many other initiatives, it will help to uh, clarify that the fight of people like Wintin is a fight for the democracy and the fight for a better Burma. And it will also help to make clear that uh, the, the policy and the treatment imposed by the government on freedom fighters like Wintin is absolutely against the basic human rights and that the, the military government has to change its policy if they want to make um, they want to get any sort in this country. So that will help, like many other things we can do, but it will help to, uh, to make understand in France especially that uh, we have to be on the side of the political activists. Yeah, we hope in the future that it, it can be translated in Burmese, in English, but uh, it's a negotiation so far with uh, uh, publishing houses and uh, we hope it, it, it will be possible uh, in, the, in the near future. But uh, I think that uh, the people will understand that uh, uh, we, as we need the support of the, the French public opinion and the French government, it was important and as Wintin is well known in, in France for what he did and what he suffered, it was important to get this book uh, published here in Paris. Okay, all uh, my questions finished. Yeah. But uh, anything else? You, uh, what do you want to mm. tell more? Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Uh, what can I add? Uh, no, I mean, this book was difficult to do. 
and to write because the government and especially the special police is always watching Wintin despite his uh, release from jail. There have been problems to get visa to travel to Burma. There have been problems to communicate information outside, but that that was made possible. And I think it's uh, it's it shows that despite all the restrictions and surveillance by the the government to prevent Wintin to be a free man, we he managed to give his uh, very unique testimony. And this book is all, also a way to challenge the government that is imposing uh, control on the information.